one of the uh, first comments I heard about how the role of a journalist was changing in this age, one of the best ones I heard, came from uh, David Weston saying that the aha came for him when he was thinking when the tsunami hit. And you know that in the past when you were in the networks, your first thought was, how can I get the anchor in there? How, how do I get the camera crew in there? And within five minutes he realized his job had changed and it was going to be verifying the credibility of all the videotape that came in there. Mm -hmm. uh, so if you think about this new age, and I, I use this example a lot for uh, when I'm teaching that, you know, Reuters was founded in uh, the 1800s because they basically sent uh, carrier pigeons across the English Channel with the information on the stock market. So if you think about what the Internet done, has done, it, in, and it, it speaks very much to, I think, what citizen journalism can do, is that breaking news, is that ability to be on the spot, is to give you multiple uh, vantage points of what's going on. There's still other incredibly important things that happen, and I, that's what I want to get back to. I don't think citizen journalism is going to save us with the very important context and analysis that needs to be done. And if you're thinking about what a journalist needs to be doing in the 21st century, especially with all the data here, it's more important than ever that you be able to put context and analysis around what's <laughs> available.